good morning uh, welcome back to the channel i think it's uh, day 7 in Einstein. so the place i was staying yesterday in the lemur square hostel i just wanted to give you a tour like now nobody is there in the room so i can give you at least a bit of tour so there are this bunking beds total 8 of them and every bunking bed has a light a socket and uh, there's a locker there you just have to put your package here and you can lock it and then explore the town so very like eight it's a 12 people so that's a big drawback like usually uh where the hostels i visited is mostly six or eight people this is a, the biggest hostel i've been to and uh, there's a common kitchen and uh, bathroom and washroom as well so mostly usually people uh, who take the hostel is just for saving the cost so this uh here the cost will be around like uh, two thousand rupees per night in Ayana, not in ISK. ISK to be I think around three thousand something. So if you are this, this will be the like the cheapest uh, bed you can get in Reykjavik. So if you want to stay in cheap, that's the best option you have. You have to stay in the hostel. Now uh, it will be starting our day. Uh, first of all, we'll go into kitchen and uh, making our breakfast. We have to check out from here because this is not available for today and tomorrow. So we have to move to some other place. Uh, then we will explore the city, that's all. So now we are in front of the most iconic place in Reykjavik. The church name Hall Grimmiskriksa. Something like that. Spelling is here. See this. Cheapest uh, grocery store in Iceland. So this is like 398 krona, somewhere around uh, 250 something in Indian currency. That is the cheapest you can get here. So we have everything here: uh, pasta, pizza, frozen pizza, and sandwiches, burger. Yes, sir, right? 84 for cold drink. Uh, just be careful about the timings of the store these stores closes very early like uh, 6 6 30 and i think only on saturday it was open until 7 30 so if you are visiting Iceland and uh, just one more thing make sure that this store open also very late like, like around 10 o'clock in the morning so you have to be come between and uh, buy all the stuff and that is the like cheapest store you'll find here this is our last day in Iceland and we are in Reykjavik near the port and we will be doing a 
whale watching tour today so just uh, we didn't book any tickets in advance so just coming came to the port and uh, finally found a counter where you can buy the tickets so this is the ticket counter and uh, uh, that is the boat will be catching whale watching and uh, i think we are paying around uh, 10000 isk so finally bought the ticket it cost us around 32000 some change in isk so indian currency it will be around 7000 something or uh, maybe 100 dollars this is the boat and they warned us like it will be very rough sea so if you have a sea sickness or that kind of issue better take a there's a tablet i don't remember the name there's a tablet uh, i'll mention the come in the description below so this was started one o'clock and it is supposed to be a three to four hour tour let's go in the boat yep terrific okay so just a couple of things as yeah. they may have told you already we are expecting it to be a bit rough out there right. today okay yeah. so uh, if you're afraid you might get seasick i would recommend taking a seasickness tablet and you can find those in the cafeteria on the middle deck okay, okay. and uh, also if you get cold or if you think you might get cold at some point during the tour yeah. some lovely overalls on the bottom okay yeah yeah hopefully yeah <laughs> don't say hopefully <laughs> let's go अरे सर वो जैकेट पहनने का हमसे कहाँ से पहनेंगे वो और मोर ऑन कोसी सिटिंग एरिया ओ ये रे चलो so we get to wear this where is m size m m m mera m nikalo mera bhi hai lo niche hai kuch hai pura hai sahi zyada hai so this is the clothes we are wearing garmi ho gayi to badhiya na baat thand bhi to hogi abhi pehne nahi pehne are pehen lo so very difficult to wear कौन सा साइज लिया तुमने पहन लिया परफेक्टो परफेक्टो गेटिंग गेटिंग रेडी फॉर द फैंसी ड्रेस टुडे आई एम वेल हंटर क्या है इसको ऐसे चिपका दे ये भी चिपक जाएगा Like it's weight more than me, I guess. Don't you dust it? Huh? Say it. How good are we? What's wrong? Hey, man, look at that. Done. So the boat has started now. Or rather, a ship. Are you done, Marra?
They don't eat that thin way of meat either. And uh, you might have seen though at the restaurants here, minky whale meat. Okay, because up until this year, another company used to take minky whales right here in the bay. Right here in the bay. And what happened is that last year, a sanctuary was extended here, and they had to go too far this year to catch them. It's not profitable, and uh, they stopped doing it. It's pretty nice, and that's thanks to people like you who come whale watching which uh, supports the, the whale watching industry and in, and in turn helps uh, helps us in our efforts of, uh, concerning the, the conservation and preservation of these very mammals. So here, for example, lots of whale watching. We've been pushing for an extension of the sanctuary and people, passengers were signing a petition and everything. So now it, it's been done. Uh, there's another place, for example, in Uzavik, there's a whole bay with a lot of whale watching where it, the bay is also a sanctuary. Right. Minky whale meat, you can still find a lot of it here at the restaurants. They import a lot of minky whale meat from Norway to meet the demand. Is it by tourists? Right. There's about 2% of Icelanders that eat whale meat more than six times a year. So most of it really is a tourist event. It's interesting. Thank you. So we are done with the tour. Spotted two, three uh, whales. But it was freaking cold. Good to be back on the lens. I just didn't have lunch properly. This is what we I took for lunch. This is Icelandic hot dog. It costed me around uh, 490 ISK, somewhere around 300. Pretty good. And uh, it's very feeling, so I think one will be enough for me. So this is our uh, last night in uh, Reykjavik, Iceland. And we are ending this trip with some uh, few beer and uh, the whatever the leftover eggs we had, we just made uh, an omelette in a microwave. So this will be the end of uh, this trip. Uh, so tomorrow me and Pratham are leaving for London from here and Anup is uh, leaving for uh, India via Denmark uh, and the day after tomorrow I'll be leaving for uh, uh, India from Heathrow, London and we'll be reaching India on Monday morning and uh, we'll start my day job again. So this will be the end of this video. Bye. Cheers.